before I move on from the NBA, there's two topics that I want to touch on. One is Zion Williamson. Zion Williamson, he looks fat. He looks fat. My brother, you've been in the news for some other stuff. Your proclivities and who you want to mess with and all that other stuff is your damn business. We ain't got to get into all of that, but this is necessary. Zion Williamson went to the free throw line the other day en route while LeBron James had dropped 30 in three quarters and had completely dominated and looked in peak physical condition and looked like an absolute stud and superstar and more key. Zion Williamson, who's more than 15 years younger, but 40 pounds heavier, went to the free throw line. Ladies and gentlemen, I saw a belly. A belly. Like when he took a deep breath, his belly bounced. That kind of belly. I mean, damn. Damn. What's up, Zion? It better not you got your ass kicked, losing by 44 points in a, in a sem- playing semifinals. Did nothing to lead and galvanize your team. Did nothing to show the man child that you are and to take over. But you look like you showed up to the game having just ate a buffet. Not something from the buffet. I said the buffet. Like you ate the damn table. It didn't surprise. I wasn't going to touch on this. Because I was embarrassed for him. But then Sports Illustrated wrote about it. And the New Orleans Times Pecune local newspaper wrote about it. So it's public information. He's fat. In basketball parlance. Not fat. Because some of you out there. Y'all give authentic meaning to fat. You know who you are. He's not that kind of fat. But for a professional basketball player who's 6'6", who the franchise is relying upon, there's a reason that when LeBron James was running and leading fast breaks, Zion was just standing back. standing back. They didn't even try to run back on defense. There's a reason for it. Because he was huffing and puffing. That's why. That's why. I mean, come on, bro. He looked like he ate the buffet. I saw him literally inhale, take a deep breath at the free throw line, and I saw a belly. Like like Austin Powers, fat bastard. Like, get in my belly. That's what I saw from a distance. From a distance. Come on, man. C- 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 come on, man. You know, I'm in the, I, I wish that I had a scintilla, a speck of your talent. Okay? You're, you're a bad brother. You could play, man. You could be a dominant force in this game. You don't have the conditioning. This, 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 listen, ladies and gentlemen, I know they got a weight clause in this contract. They got to. He got to be violating that. So he's addicted to food. It's got to be. I'm speculating, but it's got to be. It's got to be that. When you walk around like that, we 20 plus games into the season and the brother got a belly. That means off season, training camp, preseason, and a quarter into the regular season. You still got a belly. Gary Brecker, 10X Health. My, my, my man, you need to get in touch with this brother. You need to get in touch with this brother. We got to work on him. You know, Gary Brecker helped me. Got mad love for him. Okay, Gary Brecker helped me. Now, he need to help you. He need to help you. I ain't getting paid to play basketball. You are. I'm getting paid to talk about it. But Zion Williamson, in basketball parlance, is fat. It's got to change. It's got to change. 